Don't call it a comeback. Period. <laughs> We're not gonna talk about it now. We'll talk about it later, why I, I <laughs> where I've been. And all right, anyway, what is this video about today? So Pattern, a few months ago, sent me some products that I got the chance to finally try. Um, it is in my hair right now. Doesn't my hair look a fantastic mess? Mm -hmm. um, so I did film myself using the products. So you will see that in case you've forgotten, because it's been, yeah, it's been a while since I, it is so hot in here and I do not want to get up to go do something about it. Um, <laughs> but um, yeah, so I got the products. So I'm going to show you all the products that they sent to me first because I am not using them all in the demo video. Um, so let's do that first, okay? Um, so they sent me like their little, I think what they're calling like their travel little essential kit so it came with two okay it came with the cream styler the cream styler here it is um and as before all these products all these products are three dollars i mean three dollars don't we wish all these products are three ounces and nine dollars a pop i believe i believe they are nine dollars a pop if uh, if they are different price i will annotate it but for three ounces nine dollars tracy no lo podemos hacer we cannot do it we can we just cannot do it it is just especially when they make your hair look like this um so anyway so the cream styler i will be you will see this in the video the, the, the smell is decent, very, very artificial, but decent. Doesn't really linger. I don't smell it in my hair. You'll see me use that in the video. Um, what else will you see me use in the video? Um, you'll see me use this gel. There's two gels. You'll see me use this curl gel with right here. Comes in this. Um, but then I also have the Stronghold gel that we will talk about and talk about why I'm not going to use this anymore. And that's it. And I'll show you what that looks like. It's just like a clear gel. The other gel, you'll see it in the video. It's kind of creamy. Kind of took me aback. Um, I kind of expected it to look somewhat like that. Like like a transparent type of product. But it, it really wasn't. It's like a creamy. And then we have this hydrating mist that I will be trying with y'all for the first time to see if I can do something about this. Um, so boom, you'll see me use the product. I wash my hair. I always decondition and whatnot. Make sure that I clarified my hair, especially when I'm trying a new product. Um, so I did all that outside of the camera and whatnot. Um, the brush that you'll see me using, I don't know if you see me using it now because it should be somewhere where I don't know where I'll put it, but, um, I can't find my make believe Denman, so I had to use that, even though I absolutely hate that brush. But um, as per usual, I put the cream on first, run it through my hair, then go ahead and put the gel on, run it through my hair, then brush to just get a, a good definition. The brushing just helps my curls pop and whatnot. And so those are the two products I used yesterday. Doesn't my hair look like it's time for wash day? Yesterday. We got to come back and we got to come back like on a shitty note, like on a bad note. Um, so before I get into discussing how my hair feels, I'm going to tell you why I am not any longer using this Stronghold gel. Somebody did tell me a little goes a long way and I kept that in mind the two times that I used it. Um, cause I, uh, this is not the first time using this product. It's the first time using that gel, but the, not the first time using the cream. I have yet to use the mist. Um, so I've used the cream. I don't got a problem with the cream as of right now. Um, but anyway, the stronghold gel is flake city, baby. Like I'm going to insert a picture. Hopefully I don't forget. I'm going to insert actually, you know what? Yak, uh, inserting a picture because me, I'm going to forget. I'm going to just show you the picture on my phone. Um, and you can see it's a picture of me and do you see my hair? There it is. 
Do you see my hair? Do you see that? Do you see those flakes? I look like I have lice. I look like I have something has laid eggs. I look yuck. Yuck. And then you'll say, well, maybe it's the gel and the cream. If you use them together, maybe they just don't work. They're in the same line. As far as I'm concerned, if you're putting out products in the same line, they should work together. They should work together. I tried this gel on also on my daughter's hair. Flakes. Flakes, flakes, flakes. I had to wash her hair. It was terrible. So this, this is basura. Never again. So let's get into the cream. The cream, nice, thick. You don't expect nothing bad. Um, I, I haven't used it by itself, so I don't know, but I'm going to talk in a second about that. And then the gel that you saw me use. Okay. My hair looks a mess. You can see my hair. I'm going to try the hydrating spray. Um, some parts are undefined. I, as of right now, I don't really see any flakes happening, but who knows? Um, one thing I will say my scalp is so itchy like i was down here like oh my god through my bonnet i was like scra this stuff made my scalp so itchy Ugh. like i like when i'm done here i'm going to wash my hair it has to get out like my scalp just does not feel right um my hair how does my hair feel my hair feels like maybe if I fluffed it, it would look good, but it doesn't feel good. It feels very heavy with product. I'm uh, just very, very heavy with product. And I know that I'm heavy handed when I use products, but I tried not to be this time. Like I try to keep it like, you know, the, the decent amount of product. I Like I said, this is not my first time um, using the cream, but it is my first time using the gel and I try to keep it real easy because of that other gel. And I just didn't want that problem. Like I don't want to be washing my hair over and over. I just don't want to do that. So I, this is not a promo for, I don't even drink beer. This was just a, this is just like a, a sleep shirt. Don't anyway. Um, so my hair just feels very, like there's a lot of like it's built product builder very uh, like there's a i can feel it in my hands like it's very heavy residue in my hands um my curls are defined my it's not crunchy i'm very frizzy though very frizzy i don't like the way my my hair feels um and i know that this because of the way it looks it's not going to last. And you know, I can pull a good wash and go for like seven, eight days with a good product. You know, depends on how you sleep. So let's try the hydrating mist. I hate hydrating mist. I don't think that all the products smell the same, very artificial. Um, I don't like hydrating mist. It's, no, I, that is a lie. There was one. I think I reviewed it. I don't even know what it's called. I don't feel like looking for it. Um, but they just don't do it for me. They don't hydrate shit. All you're doing is all you're really doing is wetting your hair with some with some fantastic smelling water. Like you could just get the same idea. Like I think that hydrating sprays are like a waste of money when you can kind of get the same the same you know, with some water, some, you put a little conditioner, mix it up, some fragrance if you want. I know y'all are going to say, oh, but your hair looks good. But, no. It's not going to last. I mean, I just can't, like, see this? That's what I'm talking about. Like, this frizziness I don't like. I mean... I wouldn't wear it out like this, but I would like maybe throw a headband on and I just don't, I don't like the, like I'm, I don't even want to touch my hair. I don't like the way it feels. It's very heavy. Now it's wet and heavy and there goes my scalp itching. Like 
I just, no, I just, this is not something I would spend my money on. Number one, the price point is terrible. When Tracy came out with these products, I forgot, maybe two, three years ago, she said it would be affordable. I don't think nine dollars uh, $9 might sound affordable, but when I tell you three ounces, that you're buying basically travel size products for nine bucks, it's not really there. The, it weighs down my hair. It just, like, I feel like there's a lot of buildup. That flakiness situation is a big no-no for naturals, and we all know it. The last thing you want to do is be caught out there looking like, like Elsa from Frozen, and you got snow in your hair. Like, it just does not, and then my scalp is itching. Do what you will. Remember, in case you've forgotten, you take these reviews with a grain of salt. If you love these products, good for you. I'm so happy that you found something because I know it's hard out there and I'm being sincere about that. I'm happy that you found something, but they, they're not for me. My reviews are based on how I feel about how they did in my hand because there's still going to be people in the comments, but it works great for me. So I don't know what, it's good for you. A cookie? Like what? <laughs> I haven't changed y'all a little bit, but not a lot. But yeah, so that is my review on the pattern. Try it if you want. Don't if you don't. Like, I, but I wouldn't get full sizes. But I, I don't even want to tell you to sp spend nine dollars on on one on like such small amount of product. You know what you can get for nine dollars? Y'all know what y'all can get for nine dollars. Um, just. Anyway, I'm going to try to be back. I'm not going to promise y'all anything. My health, my mental health comes before social media. I'm not here to pretend. We'll talk about it if you really want to hear about it um, or anything else. Um, yeah. I can't even apologize for being gone because I need to take care of me. So anyway, I'm going to get out of here. Hopefully uh, y'all have enjoyed this, this re-entry. Perhaps my re-entry back into YouTube, but we'll see. All right, y'all. Stay safe. Fucking get vaccinated. And peace.